How's it going guys? I'm your host Corriban Gaming. Welcome back to this week's Adventure Quest video and sorry for the late video release today it was because I had something on in the morning and on top of that uh, this week's Dragon Faber release got delayed that's why you're seeing the Adventure Quest video today. Alright so for this week we actually have the let me see a Grand Walk event I believe. So yeah lots of different uh, seasonal events going on right now. The Blarney War is still ongoing. April Fools is uh, of course ongoing and I heard that Lazy Quest has been fixed. I have not really tested it out myself but but yeah, if it has been fixed, go ahead. You know, if you guys want to level up your alts or even your main characters to level 150, then Lazy Quest is the easiest way. Okay, Grand Walk Festival is also here. So three seasonal events, guys, ongoing at the same time. All right, so for today's video, we're going to be looking at this year's Grand Walk event. I already have the Grand Walk painting so i technically can access this event whenever i want to if uh, i later come back and see that there's something that i want okay uh, i believe it's overgrowth Koriba, nice to see they sent you ahead i like to catch up but things look bad i've done some of the scouting already and aim pretty how much do you know already valencia got your major's message and came straight to me so most of it <clears throat> dragon showing up in the grand walks territory forest fires going up in odd places and randomly extinguishing. Is it seriously plant dragons? Sure looks like it. You see, tracking those gets harder with this much foliage. The older ones have both an ideal camouflage and the power to bend nature around them to cover their tracks. But what's different here? Whatever came through here wasn't nearly that subtle. Plant dragon tracks and smashing a path through the forest doesn't add up. Wait, I remember a few that fell in the far west who felt displaced from the forest. Plant dragons charging into a forest should be blending in. These are turning it upside down and I know it was them because the tracks of other dragons are fresher. If it's the ones you're thinking about, it adds up. The giant horn salads tore through the forest with other dragons on their trail. Normally, they wouldn't leave a trail, so I'll assume they're leading the others into a trap. But if they're hostile to this forest, they're trying to maximize damage, fires and stampedes. <coughs> I think that's your point being proven in our direction. Hold of your point and running fast. Okay, we'll just go by ourselves and yes, we are testing out the new build that I theorized uh, just a little while back. Okay, you guys can go ahead and check out that video. It was in this week's uh, uh, release, this week's Nostalgia Quest series video, season 5 by the way. And it's been quite a while already. We still haven't seen the rest of the revamp stats. So I honestly don't know how much longer we have to wait at this point. But we'll just work with whatever we have currently. So for Earth, uh, actually can we do Doomlight? How, how much is Doom Light? Earth is 45%. Okay, Doom Light probably won't be so good here. So I'm not going to... I'm just going to use... Oh, just nice. We'll test out our Earth equipment, which is this. We can use Web Higher as well if I want to. But uh, we won't use that here. Let's see. Win. What's our win weapon? Oh, it's Big Dictionary. Shall we ch test out Dodge Slashing? Yeah, this one has 250 dexterity. I guess now would be a good time to like properly test this against like a regular mob. Okay, so let's do Frost Titan hit. And then we, uh, Big Dictionary is already out. Pets, we can just do, let me do Fey Wanderer here. Force Panic to heal me. Okay, very nice. Quad Force will, uh, give ourselves some SP first. So we have enough for the Quad Force toggle. Okay, I kind of want to boost Dexterity as well as Charisma all the way up to 250. That's what I want to do. So let's do uh, Creature 72 for the Panic. Panic, okay. Uh, mix Nuts for the first round. Let's do Walnuts. And then we can do Quad Force. Let's do Moxie for Dexterity and we technically don't need to do Charisma but I'm just going to do it here. Okay, let's do Panoply. Alright. Let's see if we have enough blocking to block this. I hope we do. Wait. It's not doing a lot of damage. Why? Oh, water is 80% only. Rebugly Poison. Yeah, unfortunately that was not that great. And our Earth Resist is really bad at 91%. Okay, not exactly what I hoped for. Let's... Oh, okay. Out of SP already. So we'll do Essence Hop. And I think what we need really is the Arms of the Dragon Guard. Okay, I think if we boost up the crit for the pets, uh, we can do some insane, insane damage. Even though it's at only at 80%. Okay, so let's do this, and then we'll do Quad Force again. <coughs> I 
Oh no. Wait. Okay, so yeah, for some reason the damage is not great, but the healing is really good though. So I'm happy with that. Uh, two more rounds in saturation. Ah, now that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Yep. So dodge lashing, obviously not as much damage as before because I don't have the summoning stone miscellaneous item. And I think this one gives like a little less damage compared to uh, the titan's force shield. But you know what? I, I'm still okay with it. Panoply again. There goes the hyper crit. Dodge slash for about 400 damage. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Dragon guard again. Oh! Oh, what do you know? Wow. Okay, that was a waste of a dragon guard. That's fine. Newton Arconoid. Alright, switch over to champion holy armor for this one. Shields will do strawberry shield cake. Let's see. Oh! Oh, wait. Oh, the SP attack is the... Ah, uh, yeah. Whoopsies, I forgot. Okay, now I'm going to try something a little different. Let's do wear pyre. Wear pyre with shield of ore. Yep. So our earth resist is 15%. Wait, no. Yeah, 15%. I think that's fine, right? And what do you want to do here? Shall we do wolf pet swarm? Hmm. Let's do this. Become the beast. Alright. Shall we do some quad force? Yeah, let's do quad force with this as well. For weapons, I think we'll do our darkness weapon. So we can heal a bit of SP also. I know the SP heal on this is pretty pathetic, but you know what? I think it's better than nothing. Okay, Dragon Lord's Might. Quad force. Now we want to do strength and charisma. First we do Dragon Guard. Oh, wait. Water heals it. Oh, darn. That can't be good. Okay. <laughs> Oops, a daisy. Okay, maybe this pet isn't that great for it. Uh, let me see here. Shields, armor. Uh, he's going to do light, right? So switch to champion holy armor and we'll do our strawberry shield cake. You know what? I'm going to turn off Curris. I'm going to turn both of those off first because we don't need them now. Let's see here. Darkness. Creatures 72 can still remain out, but for pets, you'll switch over to a Baron. Yeah. Let's attack. Alright, now switching back to Wephire. Yeah, this build requires a lot of clicking and a lot of focus. Like, you need to be very clear on what is it you're doing exactly. Otherwise, you know... <laughs> You 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 just get confused. Yeah, that's like the really the only downside of this build. But then again, you know the ability to, the ability to do just about everything is uh really fantastic as well, of course. So let me do arms of the dragon guard again. Ooh, a lot of damage from a baron, I like that. And then now let's finish him. Ooh, wow. We are doing a lot of damage too. Very nice. Okay, we should get a full heal here. Ice Dragon. Okay, so we switch over to Ice. Ice Necromancer Cavalry. Oh, this will be fun. Uh, Frost Titan Hit. Yeah, this will be really, really fun. Okay. Let's do some Elemental Vulnerability, shall we? Skills. Let's call the Wolf Bat Swarm. Yeah, I forgot to showcase this guest. I did pin a message uh, in the video. Lower your foes blocking elemental defenses. Nice. For pets, which one? Wuzak. Yeah, Wuzak is the one. Norm attack. And we'll do Ice Necromancer Cavalry. Decay Breath. 392 SP. Oh, are you serious? It missed completely? Really? You gotta be kidding me. No, come on. I mean, we do have zero dexterity, but still. 
Wait, no. Uh, BTH has been changed already, right? What the heck? Why am I not hitting? I don't understand. It should be magic damage, right? Yeah, how am I not landing a single hit on Decay Breath? What is going on here? Hold on. Is this bugged? No, come on. I can't land a single hit using Decay Breath? What is going on? Didn't they change BTH already? To make it scale with main stat? How am I not hitting anything? Oh, melee! Oh! Oh, my weapon is melee. Ah, darn it. <laughs> well, guys, it shows that I am dumb. Okay, I forgot. Uh, yeah. Does this respect weapon special? Actually, I don't know. I can't remember. Let's test this out. <clears throat> oh, yeah. No wonder it wasn't hitting because my strength is a freaking zero. Yeah, okay. That's better. Ice. Okay, 205%. Nice, that is more like it. That is more like it, guys. Chill haunting. Oh yeah, very nice. Nothing is hitting though. Hmm. Okay, let's do Decay Breath again. I mean, this is an Ice Monster, so it's not very good, but still, uh, 50%. Oh yeah, to 205 205% of 50%. I can't remember how much that is in terms of math. Oh my god. Resisted everything, really. Yikes. Yikes. Big yikes. Maybe you should have just nuked him with fire. Yeah, maybe you should have just nuked him with fire. Like it's either missing everything or it's like... Not, not as great as I thought. 216%. Chill hunting. Yeah, because it already has natural 50% resistance to ice. That's why maybe it's not that great. Ah, well, that's okay. That is okay. Book of Burns. Yep. I think we'll just do the normal one here. We'll just do in saturation. Or whatever the heal is called. I can't remember. Okay, let me just dismiss the gas. Pets will switch to Underwormling. Take away S. Take away the pixel either. Yeah, the defenses sixty six. For some reason, I I am having a lot of trouble hitting this monster. I have no idea why. Man, I think pet and guess BTH is still tied to dexterity. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah, no wonder I'm not hitting anything. Darn it. Also, I saw the suggestions that you guys gave. Thank you very much for the suggestions. Uh, I am still considering what to change out. I haven't really changed out anything yet, but I'll definitely be changing something. Energy, finally. Is it time for... No, Doomlight, you want to do water. Yeah, so for energy, we'll go with HCVs. Shields, Doomlight, Shadow Spark. Let's see here. Water weapon. Uh, water with a healing branch. For pets, we can do Fey Wanderer. Oh, is this a good time for Fey Wanderer? Maybe it is. Darkness is 110% as well. Yeah, okay. I think this is a good time for Fey Wanderer. Okay, let me see here. Uh, Essence Orb. I need some pixel either as well, right? For my... Okay, never mind. We won't do the MP heal yet. Uh, Charisma, Moxie. Apologize if this video is taking a long while because I'm still trying to figure my way out around this new build. And see what, what generally works. 
Okay, that's nice. Can you do Dragon Guard now? Yep, we can. Oh, come on, not enough MP, really? Darn it. The main reason why I'm doing Dexterity is really for the, uh, what do you call it? For the pet and guest BTH. Otherwise, they are just not going to land any hits. Yep, nice. That's better. And if they don't land any hits, then it's going to be really tough for me. I think we can do Verifying Search. Yeah, we have enough MP for that. Let's do that. Oh, the Dragon got well off already. That was fast. That was fast. <clears throat> nice look at that damage all right next <coughs> that looks new i'm going to let you handle this one you're the one try your experience fair enough something doesn't look right with her though hey are you all right too much. Not used to this much power. I can't see shit. I've been fighting for so long. I've got an idea of what the dragons are after now. Maybe you can help. I've worked with your sisters before. Kind of. Help, please. Yes. I'll be dragon reavers. No, not again. Not now. You have wounded this land enough. Lady, I'm a dragon slayer. Not a puppet of <laughs> nature will consume you. The other kind of help it is. And <laughs> yeah, the other kind of help knocking them out. Okay. Is this the boss already? Boss boost plus 15 freedom so you can't stun it. Damage cap 78. Wow. Minus 20 with BTH. So this will be good for dodge, dodge lashing, I guess. Uh, Earth. Okay. Weak to water, weak to wind. Shall we go back to dodge lash? I feel like dodge lash is the way to go because of the berserk status. That's going to help us a lot. Yeah. Maybe we have it reflect sunlight first. Yeah, for the blind. Yeah, for the blind, we'll have it reflect sunlight first. Let me see here. Then for this one, I'm going to do Essence Orb first of all. I think we have to set up the blocking first before we set up the Dragon Guard. Yeah, we have to do that. Okay. Uh, let me see. I think, can we afford to do one Power Gauntlet? Yeah, I think we can. Crush. Okay, that's good. Landed. Blocking will do big dictionary. Oh god, eight nine seven. Sets you on fire. Ferocious strike. Hmm. Twenty-one to block okay, uh Fire damage each round. Fire resist is not very good either. Thankfully, we have a bunch of HP to make up for it. But, one hit from him is hits extremely hard. So, we'll need to turn on Charisma. I need to turn on Dexterity as well. Arms of the Dragon Guard. Okay, this shouldn't be a problem anymore. Let's see. Yep. Okay, that's good. Now we'll have the dodge lashing properly. Okay. Uh, let me see. What do I want to do now? Panoply again? You don't need to. Let's do the wind attack. Oh, the damage cap, isn't it? Yeah, the stupid damage cap. Even dodge lashing has the freaking damage cap. Wow. <laughs> Can't say I'm a fan of that, but what to do, right? What to do? I guess multi-hits is the way to go. Arms of the Dragon Guard again.
Yeah, dodge lashing is painfully slow because of the damage cap. Even the lash damage is like capped. I didn't know it was capped. Is it like a new thing or something? Yeah, I really didn't know. That is not good. <clears throat> I mean, we are still unhittable, so that's a good thing, I guess. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, wait a minute. Now it's minus 30 penalty and the damage cap is gone. Ah, okay, okay. I see what's going on now. Yeah, that's better. Much, much better. Ooh, in that case, I probably shouldn't have used the power gauntlet so early. That was a waste. Yeah, that was my bad. Totally my bad. Okay. Nice. Full heal. And boom. Alright, awesome. I'm starting to see a pattern in forcefully empowered people losing coherence. Cyrus and I were discussing that idea around the time you, let's say, came back. We'll have to swap notes on that sometime. You'll probably have a better clue than we do now. Galanov, it's just, I know I... Don't worry about it. We can talk about it when you're ready. It's one heavy topic for sure and I know I wouldn't like to be put on the spot about my issues. Besides, your friend looks better already. Chosen, thank the fates. I am Kayan. Kane of summer we need your help let me guide r save your strength all that power look like it hurt worse than the fight i can handle the pain but the power those dragons are making it run wild it's hard not to lose ourselves if i start moving or fighting again i feel i might lose focus again hurry please <coughs> Tell us the details and we'll be off to try and fix this then i know it looks urgent but if your sisters aren't themselves right now better to go in inform than rush blindly and make it worse oh don't look at me like that we'll, we all have an awkward past the plant dragons have been doing as much damage as they can. They're trying to provoke the forest, make it react with all it's got. They'll get more than they bargain for, but we all, we'll all pay the cost as well. There are still plenty of greedy dragons out there, so I'm not surprised some would do this, but what do they even get out of this? I was starting to think it was the dryads, but leaving this one behind proves that. Nothing comes to mind that isn't much worse, much as it pains me. We have to follow the trail of raging forest guardians and calm them down the old-fashioned way. We can write them heartfelt apology letters and... When we are done saving the entire place. Now come on, we've got plotting dragons to stop. Okay, heartfelt apology letters, probably not, but yeah, we'll probably just wreck them or something. <laughs> uh Doomlight Shadow Spark. This one hits with nature as well as uh this one hits with earth as well as water, right, if I'm not mistaken. So maybe you can do a bit of backlash? Water is 95, Nature, Earth is 70. Yeah, I think Backlash will be pretty good against this. So yeah, let's try and Backlash this. This one has quite a lot of HP, so I'm not sure how well Backlash is going to work, but hopefully it works. Okay, uh, we'll do Essence of Carnage. And then we'll do Spotter Drake. Some of you guys have commented that Spotter Drake is overkill because we don't really need the status potents. We'll see, okay. I mean, we are taking a bit less Earth damage as well, so that's good. Oh, Earth is... Earth is minus 100%, okay. Uh, Backlash... Oh, he regenerates as well! Oh, darn it. Darn it. He regenerates. Let's see here. Okay, the regeneration is pretty strong, but our backlash is also pretty strong. I don't think we need the spotter drake for the for that, right? Okay, we'll have it swap to underwhelming instead. Underwhelming will just do damage to him. Yep, little bit of chip damage, better than nothing. Hmm, maybe this isn't the best way. Yeah, maybe backlash isn't the best way to deal with this. Let's do... Let me test out the burn part of the build. Yeah, energy is 0%. Yeah, energy is not going to burn him. Okay, uh, what other burn... What's the other burn gas we have? Instead of Spell Slinger, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, like, C. Ray Skeleton, Deathless Draco Leech. Burn, okay. Armor, what's our other burn armor? God, I can't remember what's the other burn armor. Oh, we don't have one. Yeah, we don't have one. It's literally in the weapon. Okay. Uh, Ultra Guardian Ropes. 
Chills. Snuggle Hearts for the Burn Potence? Nah, I don't think we need it. I don't think we need the Burn Potence, but I'll bring out Crack Tournament just in case. Scorch. Okay. Two six nine three. Oh yeah, cause it uh there's the heal as well, so it all stacks up together. But we are definitely out damaging the heal with the burn. So let's see if he's healing two hundred plus, and let's see how much we're doing the burn. Oh, six hundred plus. So technically we're doing eight hundred plus burn damage already. Yeah, but because he has the heal, it negates about two hundred plus of the burn. But still, wow, <laughs> burn is crazy, man. Look at that. 21.85 power burn. Yep, this guy is dead. Boom. 1,800 something damage, I think. Very nice. Spring Dryad. This one hits it all first, right? The nuke is water, right? If I'm not mistaken. Please tell me I'm not mistaken. Yeah, yeah, I'm not mistaken. Okay, good. Uh, <clears throat> Berserk. Minus 20. Energy will be good. I guess. Yeah, fire will do decent as well. Shall we continue with the burn build? I'm going to do a bit of pixel either here. And then we can do no not quad force. Yeah, so you can see here guys, this build literally does everything. There was uh one key point or key element that I missed out in the build that now that I remember I kinda want to include inside and that is uh fragile. But Fragile, that I don't really know how I'm supposed to fit the armors inside. Because right now, there's like Shadow Walker of Time Fragile, which is the better one. There's Decimator, and then there's also the Shinyaro form. But I don't know how to fit these armors into my current build. If you guys have any idea, let me know. Alright. I really want to fit Fragile inside here. So am I trying to do too much with this build? I don't know, man. Man, all miss? Seriously? Come on. I see we generate two. No, right? Pet for some reason cannot seem to hit anything. Or the guest for some reason cannot seem to hit anything. Not good. Oh man, the lag is real. Why is this so laggy? Why is this so laggy? Come on, Scotch. Please hit. Yes, yes, thank you. Landed. Oh, oh, siphon. Oh my god. Oh, the attack heals. That was the water attack though. But when does it use the water attack? That's the thing I'm worried about. I don't know when it uses the water attack. And the water attack hits pretty hard. Yeah, whoops a daisy. I should have done pixel either. That's the earth attack again. Oh, does it run out of mana then do the water attack? Actually, I have no idea. But we'll switch to this. Please tell me it's doing water. If it does earth, uh, 68%. I could be in a bit of trouble, but the berserk, hopefully it doesn't hit me with that. Hopefully the berserk helps me more than it harms me. Okay. We generate a bit of SP and convert this to MP. Yeah, good thing I put in Pixel Eater here because it's still coming in handy. I mean, I could just chuck the mana pot if I wanted to, but uh, we'll try not to do that with the new build. Let's see how far I can get without chugging pots using this new build. All right. Scotch. Thirty-one point seven two power burn. This should one shot it, right? Almost, almost. Very close. Yeah, do I still have to do anything? I don't think I have to. Oh, Lucky Blaze. Very nice. Yep, I'm pretty sure it's dead the next turn either way. Okay, there we go. <coughs> fire Seed Spitter. So we'll switch to our Fire Armor here. And our Fire Armor is... We don't have one, so it's actually Doom Light. Uh, sixteen percent. All right, we'll do we'll do this, and it's about to do its SP attack, which I don't know what it is, but I don't want to find out. So we'll get underwhelming. Oh wait, no, underwhelming can't damage it. Darn it! 
Uh, I assume it's fire as well. Water, okay. Fey Wanderer. Creature 72. Hmm. What should I do here? Dragon Guard? No, Dragon Guard won't be good. It's essentially healing him. But our pet and guest will do more damage though. The the pet will probably nuke him to death, but Yeah, I think we'll just do Dragon Guard. Yep, that's what we'll do. Okay, gain some SP for the Quad Force first to make sure I land my hits. And Courage, Moxie. Actually, I don't know what I want to do with the weapon. Just backlash weapon? Yep, I think maybe we'll just do the backlash weapon. Oh, okay. That's a nice heal. Alright. Arms of the Dragon Guard. Alright, you get a bit of a heal, but the pet is going to do a lot more damage. Oh my god, nice. And we're basically fully healed up. Awesome. Whoo! Wow. Okay, pet should kill it. That's what I'm talking about. I love this build, guys. I love this build. <laughs> Summer Dryad. Okay, another Dryad. This one, Earth. Okay. Earth Armor. We'll do in... Shall we do Web Hire? I feel like I want to do Web Hire. Yeah, let's play Web Hire a little bit. Guardian of the Forest. Uh, this one, Damage Cap as well. Yeah, again with the stupid Damage Cap. Let's see, wind or dark? I think we have to go with dark here. Don't forget to turn on quad force as well. So I can land the hits. Hmm, <coughs> quad force. Wait, we don't need it yet. Yeah, we don't need wait, no we do, we do. Uh Courage and Moxie first. We have to turn on strength as well later on. Okay, do we even have enough for another one? Yeah, this is really pushing it, 3 skills. But, let's try. Should get, yup, some SP heal from here as well. I think that should be sufficient to upkeep it. No, 363 only though. Hmm, yeah, this is... It's a bit dicey here. Generate some SP and then go back to Quad Force Power, Courage, Moxie, Dragon Guard. Monster goes berserk. Okay, now's our chance to kill it before it kills us. Essence Orb. I think we should be able to one-shot this thing. I think our normal attack will one-shot it. Okay, nice. We do. <clears throat> what in the blazers? There's our query. Ah, now you might actually pose trouble of all the people to interrupt me, it'll have to be the butcher and the chosen, but do you really want to risk the consequences of a ritual like this being interrupted? Oh good, we're getting straight to the part where you think you can get me to see things your way. Now let's skip to the part where I demand a quick explanation, then stop you, peacefully or violently, that is up to you. After the mess you've made though, I'll be careful about validating my preference. I wasn't the first dragon to come here, you know, nor the first one with the idea, but I was the only one experienced enough to know what to do. I'm surprised you can't tell, I haven't run into this magic so often. Should see the benefit in an elder of nature taking it. The younger ones would try to devour this power and squander it on petty disputes. I myself almost did. All power that is lost has to find a new host. These scraps of divinity though, they stubbornly refuse to stop flowing. The very for forest clings to it like a stubborn grave. But once I've turned enough of its own power against it, then enough of it should be exposed in retaliation to be ripe for the taking. That doesn't feel right. Is that how it works? I don't think so. This already has a new host, I think. But how do I know this? Seize your silent nonsense, you pompous sack of 
tweaks. I've heard some pretentious dragons in my life, but you're making me owe Cyrus an apology for half of the things I've called him. <laughs> or maybe a third. Now let's get this over with. I can feel my beard growing from the weight. Very well, you'll face the wrath of Arok the Nature Dragon, Tin Man, and you'll scream the names of my fallen kin before your last breath. Oh my god, now what in the world did that? That is one ugly campfire. The forest, he said it was making it fight its own magic. It created something to fight, nature. How did you even figure that out so fast? Never mind, eyes on the walking modern art. Get it before it burns the whole place down. Ash Drake. Uh, oh, this one has backlash. Okay, okay. Interesting. Uh, backlash monster, backlash versus backlash. Who's the king of backlash? Okay, uh, weak to water, wind, and ice. Shall we try and backlash it one time? I feel like we should try. Yeah, I feel like I want to try. I really want to try. Really, really badly want to try. <laughs> Let's do it. Uh, water, wind, and ice, huh? Oh, but... You know what? The, the elemental vulnerability will be so good as well. Like, literally so good. Like, I, I will literally just kill him with the elemental vulnerability. Uh, let's just attack, I guess. I'm going to do crack ornament here because of his boss boost. I'm not sure how confident I am of being able to inflict that backlash thing. Fire is 42%. Okay, uh, backlash is alright. Yeah, it's alright. The pet is doing pathetic amounts of damage, so I'm probably not going to use the pet wind or ice instead. Uh, maybe we'll do Comintoid Jelly for the heal. I think that might be that might work a little better than Fey Wanderer. Uh, yeah, a little bit better, just a little bit. Okay, he's not doing a lot of damage to us, but at the same time, we're also not doing a lot of damage to him. I think we need to boost... I need, We need to get a bit more SP because uh, this can be quite SP intensive as well. He's also going to do his nuking skill next, which I don't know what it is. But... We'll eat the nuking skill, see how it goes. <clears throat> yeah, we'll eat the nuking skill and... Hopefully, we'll backlash a good amount back onto him as well. 5, 4, 8, 5. Wait, what? Stun it to avoid a massive attack. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's like Bun Banneret, I guess. I'm not sure how strong is the massive attack. Is it going to be a one-hit KO or what? But I don't want to find out. So, we'll just do this. And yeah, that that's basically done. Yeah, it could be a one-hit KO. If it is, then you definitely want to stun it. But I don't want to take my chances here. It could not be. And then like we could just like backlash a good amount back. But <laughs> yeah, I really don't want to take my chances here. So we'll do this instead. Okay, and we are losing in the backlash battle, unfortunately. Shall I do... Okay, let's change strategies here. Yeah, let's change strategies here. First of all... Let's do the ice one. Yeah, let's do ice elemental vulnerability. Wolfpack swarm. Okay, pets will have shiny wuzard. And then we'll have the... Wait, no, before that... I need more SP. Shadow Feeder, please work. Nope. Not working. Why? Why is Shadow Feeder not working? Come on. Come on. Still no? Really? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Come on, Shadow Feeder. Why don't you Shadow Feeder? I'll literally die inside Ice Necro Cavalry. So yeah, I need Shadow Feeder.
Just need one turn. Yes, thank you. Okay. Uh, wait, what do I want to do now? Okay, we got the extra turn, so now... Wait, no! Oh, darn it. My god, what am I doing? <laughs> I'm so dumb. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? Ah, what a waste of a shadow feeder. Meant to click on skills. Why am I so stupid? Oh man. Misclick. Big fat misclick. Sorry guys, I have no idea what I'm doing actually. Uh Okay, now we need to do Shadow Feeder again because I messed up earlier. Yes. All right, awesome. Now we are talking 195%. Okay, let's freaking go. Uh, do we take? Do we take the risk? I don't think we can nuke him down here. Uh, okay, we don't take the risk. We wait for the next turn. Yeah, we wait for one more turn. Then we get another shadow feeder round going first. Yeah, okay, we'll wait for the next turn and then we'll get another Shadow Feeder round going. 410, 435. Guys, this is stupidly broken. Watch me nuke this guy to death. Watch me nuke this guy to death. Do I even have to... Uh, you know, I'm feeling pretty confident. I'm feeling pretty confident. That we don't need to. Do you think I should? I don't know. I feel like I don't. Yeah, this is... Oh, I almost backlashed myself to death though. <laughs> Look at that amount of damage. This is insane, man. 400% elemental vulnerability. I can't thank you enough. Arok may not have been the most powerful dragon, but his knowledge of magic while years behind made him more of a threat. Now the forest creatures can find a home to heal. I'm not finding the bigger picture yet myself. On the one hand, it's good that this new power of the forest can't be snatched away just like that. On the other, it raises some questions about its origin and draws hostile attention. In time, we'll be sure enough to rebuff any such attempts. <coughs> <coughs> but it's hard to react quickly when a number of the wilder dragons set their sights on what they think is a source of power. Don't I know it? At least it'll make for an interesting conversation with our blue-winged friend. I want to see his face when we tell him his people will have to take gardening classes from mine. I don't know, I think he'll appreciate the humor more than you might think. Kane, I know you had little choice, but thank you for trusting us. I hope to be able to speak to more of your sisters without having to fight first. I can't speak for all of my siblings, but the idea is certainly gaining popularity. Here's to brighter times chosen. <clears throat> Alright, so for the shop, uh, we don't have official info subs yet. I have the unofficial ones up here. Okay, so the armor, Summer Dryad Rem Raymond's. Okay, it's a neutral fire armor and it's uh, no notable secondary resist. Normal attack is two hits and it comes with two skills. The first skill is Fire Ward. Change armor lean to fully defensive. It applies a barrier worth uh, something something percent melee where it hits cap at 8. The monster is affected by a burn status. Okay. Hmm. The armor is currently bugged to apply a smaller barrier than intended. Is that even good? And wildfire, which is the second skill, changes armor lead to fully offensive. The armor attack to 3 hits and locks normal attack to range fire. Normal attack is gained early comp to compensate. If the monster is affected by a burn status, attacks deal extra 20% damage. Otherwise, attacks take a minus 5% damage down trigger. I think I'll just get this for fun. Why not? 
yeah i think i'll just get this this is more like for ranger builds uh effect rangers if you want to play the burn status then you can use this armor wise uh, i don't know how i feel about the artwork probably gonna give it like a yeah this is like a 5 out of 10 for the artwork sorry i'm not such a big fan of this it looks like a freaking it looks like a garbage sheet <laughs> yeah i don't know what's a better way to word this it just looks like a freaking garbage sheet pile of leaves armor so not not my favorite artwork that's for sure only 5 out of 10 for the effects wise on paper because it's bugged to be a little bit more underpowered i probably only gonna give it a 5 out of 10 as well but let's test this out okay okay let's see here start battle shields armor weapons we'll use this dismiss guess all right so 53 55 50 the blocking is actually not bad primary resist is fire at 39 percent don't really have a secondary resist earth and light is 60 percent which is pretty weak 77% for water, energy, darkness, and wind is at 90%, and it's weak to ice at 100%. So attack. Yeah, okay, skills. Let's check out skills. Fire, ward, burial, and hitting burning foes. Okay. So let's try and get the foe burning. Okay, we won't stack the burns to a, like a ridiculous amount. So we just do one burn. Let's see how good this is. So uh, what does it do? What does this do? Barrier? Monster is affected by burn status. Yeah. Wait. The monster is still hitting through. Oh. You, it's, oh, you can only toggle it once per battle. You can't change it anymore afterwards. Yeah, you can only set it once per battle. Where is this barrier? I don't understand. Am I missing something? Am I missing something here? What what what's the barrier? Where is the barrier? Yeah, what 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 is the barrier supposed to do? Sorry, I don't understand. I'm not seeing anything pop up here. Maybe it's just bugged. Yeah, maybe it's bugged. I'm not seeing any barrier of any sort. And it doesn't seem to be taking it out of my MP or my SP either. So yeah, a little bit confused on what that does. Pretty sure the burn was short enough to do whatever I want, but okay. Uh, we'll change this to wildfire. Range fire. Still respects weapon specials though. And then we can do exalted unity. Let's see. Oh, oh, okay. Now it's a tree hit. Oh, okay. Ellie comp. Hmm. Extra 20% damage. Otherwise, takes a minus 5% damage down trigger. Yeah. I mean, I do have zero dexterity. So the damage is okay. For someone with zero dexterity. But, hmm. Is it good though? I don't really know, man. Let's refresh the burn. Then what I'm going to do here is I'm going to use Quad Force and give myself 250 Dexterity. So let's see how this works. Is, does it work a little bit better now? Oh, oh, okay. 1000 over for the crit. Okay. Wow, the damage is actually not bad. Wow, if you're a Ranger, you inflict the burn. The damage is actually pretty good. Hmm. Alright, uh, I changed my mind. Practicality-wise, I would say... 8 out of 10. Yeah, 8 out of 10. The downside is that you can only switch it once per battle. And of course, the ward skill, I think it's just bugged. But the the wildfire skill is really pretty good. So yeah, uh, garbage looking art, but pretty decent effects wise. I hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. If you have, be sure to give this video a thumbs up. And of course, subscribe to this channel if you guys would like to see more of such future content. Till the next time, I'm your host, Carbon Gaming. Peace out.